Hello everybody, I'm back with another video and today it is journaling time. This is the journal that I use. Um, it's a Moleskine rule notebook. I barely started working on this, so there hasn't been any need to take out pages or anything like that. Um, this, let's see, all right. This is the spread that we're going to be working on. Uh, let me show you all the supplies. So I have like a bunch <laughs> of sticker sheets. I have uh, like little ephemera. I have papers, little papers and things like that. Little stickers, big art paper that we can play with and as well. That's the three books. So I have these three and I selected a few things that I, I also can use. So yeah, follow me on this journaling uh, and let's get started. So we'll start with this piece right here. Oh shit, okay. Surprised I don't start with the washing. <laughs> um, I mean, I will use it, but I just didn't start with it this time. Okay, so we put this down. I've been really happy that I have been able to dedicate more time to my journaling because it's really nice. Like it's, you know, it's a creative outlet and it led me to daily journaling, which I also think it's cool. So I don't know, I'm just... Having lots of fun here. When I first started my channel, I didn't think it was all gonna be um, art journal, but here we are. It's one of my staples now. <laughs> I really, really enjoy it. Just gathering all of the uh, supplies to see what what I can come up with. It's pretty nice as well.
And you know, as an artist, you were like, ooh, I accomplished another book. Or stuff like that. space ah there we go I can put this right here let me see what I got in these books. Hmm. Sometimes I forget where I, why I choose like a certain page. I don't know like what, what it was. <laughs> I don't want to use this one. Well, maybe, you know what? I'll leave those for the end, but this one I do when I use, so let me use it right now. I just made like a big, big order at a sticky club, <laughs> and I can't wait for those to come by. I think I need to buy another one of these because I have these. That I bought there, and I think I need another one because I'm getting like I don't know, like 10 20 more sheets. I forgot how many I ordered. Okay, so this is it for now. So I'm gonna jump to this page and then I'll see if I can add those stickers that I got over there. Here we are starting up page with washi <laughs> if it's not the left it's, it's gonna be the right but a page is starting with the wash oh yeah and my next time uh, our journaling video is gonna be with the art journal snacks because I got the pres the subscription for the prescription. I was gonna say the subscription for that one, and that one I'm super super excited um, to to get like to work on. I already recorded recorded the like the unboxing and. I was very pleased. That's a lot of art supplies, which I rarely use on journals, but I was thinking of using those uh, for like a, you know, when I do the splatters of paint, I maybe I can use some of the supplies that they gave me there use them for the illustration I don't know I'll see but I'm very excited about that one too
I just love how uh, choices in my supplies. Because when I started, I had very limited supplies, obviously, because I was barely knowing what I was doing. So those journals are rough. <laughs> but I learned a lot from them. And if I ever get to, like... Because when I choose a song for the journals, it's like a song at random. So... Um, if I ever get to those songs that I did at the beginning, I could do it with like another perspective or something like that. Better materials, uh, but maybe the same vibe. <clears throat> but yeah. I don't know, journaling is fun. The more supplies I have, the more time it takes me to like come, like to choose, and that sucks. There's some papers that I know that I have, so like I can reach out to those, but I really want to see everything that I have so I can make a decision.
I don't know how he turned out. And it has such a pretty, <laughs> this one has such a pretty picture in the back, but I really like the front for this one. I feel like I should have gotten two of them because I really like both sides, but yeah, here we are. This one I didn't quite calculate, but he goes a little bit over this page, but that's fine. And this paper is the one that I had to like take out from my What's Next sketchbook. The video sub now, so if y'all want to check that out, it's the tour of that sketchbook. Uh, but yeah, this is that paper, and I was like, let me use it for something, and here it is in my journals. I really want to do this. So why not? Or this one, but wait. I don't like it just like that. Has to be something. There you go. Now I like it. This is the 15. 
Let me throw this guy. Right there. together right okay yeah it's good okay so this is kind of a challenge all right here we go I think that's it. Uh, let me go get some paint. I think we're gonna do the black. Let's make this dark. Make this darks. Um, so I'm gonna bring some black and just finish this up. All right, found the paint. It's this acrylic cheap pass paint from Target. The color black. So we just throw some water few drops a few drops of this paint just one drop is enough honestly there we go Wow, that's just absorbing the paint. A lot of water. Can we just put some splash? Let's go over this. Have it. That's the final touch. Um, we can add another. There. All right, and for all this is it. Overall, I really, really like how it turned out. Um, uh, really like my illustration. It looks, he looks cool. He looks cool. So. Yeah, I really like this. Uh, I'm gonna start working the mini journal for this one as well. I'm still, I don't know which of those two choose yet, but um, I'll see right now when I'm working on it. And yeah, subscribe if you like journaling videos, and I'll see you guys in the next video.